Hello my friends, hello again. I'm Kyle. I'm Kyle and here on my channel, yes I have I bring you real English, real English that you can understand. This video is going to be part two of interesting facts, interesting facts about each of the 50 United States. All right, if you have not seen part one yet, I'll put a link down in the description, go check it out. So today is going to be part two of interesting facts about the United States Maybe you guys are seeing, ¿Dónde está? Where is he at? Where is the black background with the flags? Guys, I'm in my new house. I'm in my new house. And in a couple days when I have my wife here to help me film, because she's my beautiful little camera wife, she can help me make a video. I'll show you guys all around the house. Hopefully we'll have some new things. Uh, have some furniture and stuff, because right now I'm sitting on the floor. I'm sitting on the floor because we don't have anything here yet. Okay? So in my new house, super excited about that. One more thing before we get started, I wanted to tell you guys, if you have an Instagram, go follow me here, please. Go follow me here. I want to be able to use the Instagram to reach you guys because I was thinking, I want to be able to ask you guys about topics for videos or questions and ideas. So if you have not already followed me, go follow me here on the Instagram so we could work together more to make the channel better. I know a couple of you guys already have. I noticed uh, Alex and Emmanuel. Thank you guys for following me over on uh, Instagram and TikTok. Appreciate you guys. All right, who's ready? Who's ready? Interesting facts about the United States. Parte dos. Did you know that the state of Iowa is the largest producer of pork, corn, and eggs in the United States? And pork is the meat from a pig. And in Iowa, there are many pigs. There are four pigs for every one human. That's a lot of pigs. The next state, Kansas. An interesting fact about Kansas is that two of the biggest fast food chain restaurants started in Kansas. And those two chains are Pizza Hut, Pizza Hut, and White Castle. I don't like either of these. I do not think either of these are good. If you want a hamburger, I don't know why you would want to go to White Castle. The hamburgers are little and greasy. And if you want pizza, I don't know why you would go to Pizza Hut. I think Pizza Hut stinks, okay? I don't think their pizza's good. So I don't want to go to Kansas. Kentucky. The next state is Kentucky. The interesting fact about the state of Kentucky is that there is a military base, a military base in Kentucky called Fort Knox. And this is no ordinary base. This is the military base. The United States stores its entire reserve of gold oro. The United States stores its gold at a military base called Fort Knox in Kentucky. And in Fort Knox, there's roughly six billion, billion, mil millones, okay? Billion, six billion dollars worth of gold. I would love to see that. That would be so cool. Next date. Louisiana. An interesting fact about Louisiana is that there is a very heavy French influence on the state. And in fact, there is a very well-known uh, holiday festival in Louisiana called Mardi Gras, which in French means Fat Tuesday. Mardi is Tuesday, Martes, and Gras means fat. So Mardi Gras is Fat Tuesday, and this party is about eating, drinking, and doing a bunch of not so good things before Lent, okay? Lent is the Catholic uh, tradition, holiday, I don't know how to say it, I'm not Catholic, where you give up something that you like. For example, if I love chocolate, then for Lent, I'm supposed to stop eating chocolate. In Louisiana, right before Lent, they celebrate a huge party, a huge festival, and do all their sins before they try to be better for Lent, so. Uh, Louisiana is a pretty cool state. I've been to New Orleans. They have super good seafood and you know, I'm not a, a big partier, but if you enjoy parties, drinking, music, New Orleans is a cool place to go. So Louisiana is cool. Next state, Maine. And what Maine is very well known and famous for is their lobster, lobster industry. Maine produces roughly 90% of all the lobsters that we eat here in the United States and they have a festival. They have a big lobster festival, a big party about lobsters there once a year. And on that one day, 20,000 lobsters are eaten. Next, Maryland, Maryland. So 
An interesting fact that I found about the state of Maryland is that the official sport of the state is jousting. Jousting. I didn't know people still joust, but in Maryland, jousting is apparently a popular sport. It's kind of cool. I, I think it's kind of cool. Next state that I'm going to tell you an interesting fact about, Massachusetts. Try and say that word, guys. That's a good one. Massachusetts. Can you say it? Massachusetts, Massachusetts, Massachusetts. All right, guys, an interesting fact about Massachusetts is that two very popular sports were created there, okay? And these two sports, which I'm positive that you guys know about because they're known all around the world, basketball and volleyball, okay? Basketball and volleyball were created in Massachusetts. So I would say Massachusetts has contributed something good to the world. Next, Michigan. Michigan is a state right next to my state and I've spent a lot of time there, okay? I've seen a lot of cool things in Michigan and one of the cool places that I have been in Michigan that I wanna tell you something about is called Mackinac Island, okay? Mackinac Island is way up north in Michigan and to get there, you have to take a boat. You have to take a boat. You cannot drive there. You cannot drive there, you have to take a boat to get there and once you get to the island, the interesting thing that you will see is that there are no cars no cars and it is because it is illegal it is illegal to have a car on the island so the only thing you will see is bicycles and horses there are tons of horses and people use the horses to get around on the island guys Mackinac Island is beautiful it's a beautiful place as a matter of fact I would love to go there again and make a video for you guys because Mackinac Island is truly a very cool place so maybe we'll do that this summer when it's a little nicer or maybe it might be a cool winter video. Minnesota. The next state I'll tell you about is Minnesota. And Minnesota is known as the land of 10,000 lakes, okay? They say that there are 10,000 lakes in Minnesota, but the real number is around 12,000. There are more or less, more or less 12,000 lakes in Minnesota. That's a lot. And because there are so many lakes, there's actually more more land that is shoreline, a shore is the, the area around a body of water, than in California, than on the coast of California. That's a pretty interesting fact. The next state that I will tell you about is Mississippi. A fact about Mississippi is that it was once one of the richest states in all of the US, and it is now one of the poorest. Why is that? Well, because in the past, the big, huge industry in Mississippi was cotton farming. Cotton is a, a plant that they use to make shirts. Okay, this shirt is probably made of cotton. It has cotton in it. And the reason they were able to make so much money off of this in the past is because of slavery, okay? So they had slaves who did all this work for free, made all this money in the cotton industry, and these people who owned the farms were able to get filthy rich, okay? But after Abraham Lincoln ended slavery, it was no longer a profitable industry because if you had to pay workers to come and do all the work, you couldn't make as much money. So Mississippi went from one of the richest countries to one of the poorest. Next state that I will tell you about, Missouri. Missouri. An interesting fact about Missouri is that in the year 1947, the first drive through restaurant was invented. So a drive through restaurant is where you, you go to say McDonald's, you drive up, you say, hey, I'd like a Big Mac, I'd like a large fry, I'd like two quarter pounders, I'd like a large drink, I'd like a milkshake, I'd like a 20 piece chicken nugget, I would like chicken. Okay, you go and you tell them your order, and then you drive around, and you pay, they give you your money and you drive home, and you get to eat your food. So before they invented this in Missouri, you had to actually go into a restaurant, sit down and order your food. Missouri made it easy for you to go and pick up your food without even leaving your car. Did they help us or did they hurt us and make us lazier? I don't know. Next state, the state of Montana. An interesting fact about Montana is that it is home to two very large animals. First, it has a very large population of grizzly bears. Okay, grizzly bears are the, the biggest and most aggressive bears in the United States. Así que cuidado, cuidado con los grizzly in Montana. And next, 
Montana is one of the only places in the United States where you will still see buffalo freely roaming around and eating and being buffalo, okay? That's pretty cool. Next state, Nebraska. Nebraska. An interesting fact about Nebraska is that the drink, the drink Kool-Aid was invented there, okay? Kool-Aid was invented in Nebraska and it is home to a famous person who maybe some of you guys who like uh, to learn about business may know about, Warren Buffett. Okay, Warren Buffett is from Nebraska and he still lives there. One quick interesting fact about Warren Buffett that I like, Warren is a multi-billionaire, okay? He's one of the richest men in the world, but he still lives in a small house in Nebraska, okay? So all the money in the world did not change Warren. He's still a normal guy. He's almost 90 years old now, and he's been living in the same tiny little house in Nebraska for, I don't even know, 60 years. And he's one of the richest guys to ever live. So Warren's pretty cool, I think. Okay guys, the last state that I'm gonna tell you about today is Nevada. Maybe you guys haven't heard of Nevada, but I am positive that you have heard of a big city and a big famous city in Nevada, and that is Las Vegas. Okay, Las Vegas is in Nevada. I'm positive you guys have heard about that. You go to Las Vegas to gamble, to play cards, to try and make some money. And there are some other things that are not so good in Las Vegas. For example, Las Vegas is the only place in all of the United States where there is a, a city that has legal prostitution. Okay, so Las Vegas is kind of a place to go do bad stuff, all right? Gamble, lose your money. I told you about the prostitution, so really there's nothing in Las Vegas that interests me. However, Nevada, the state, has some cool stuff. For example, it is home to the extraterrestrial highway. And highway is a big road, como carretera. And the extraterrestrial highway is a place where many, many people claim to have witnessed UFOs. UFO uh, stands for unidentified flying object. You guys say ovnis, okay? But here we say UFOs, which is a spaceship. <laughs> For aliens or extraterrestrials. All right, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Leave me a comment, give me a like. I appreciate you all so much. I wish you all the best of luck. Y ánimo con tu inglés. Como siempre, muchísimas gracias por ver. Y nos vemos pronto.